think the reason I really love football is that it brings people together from all walks of life, all communities, it gives you friendships that really do last for a long time. And yeah, I just love that it really brings everyone together. The reason I wanted to become a referee, I think, was I'd grown up with it, going along to watch my dad referee. My mum also used to work in football, so going along and seeing her being involved as well. I realised I wanted to get into football when I was about 16. You can be a referee at the age of 16, and I said to my friends, I can go and sit the referee course now. And uh, they said, but girls don't referee. I just couldn't believe they said it, and I was basically like, I'll show you then. At that point, I didn't really think I'll continue on to this. I thought, you know, I'll go and do it, a couple games, see how it is, and I've just fallen completely in love with it, and nine years later, here we are. The opportunities that I've gained through refereeing have been absolutely amazing. They now become a FIFA assistant referee and the opportunities that it's given me to referee in World Cup qualifiers, Champions League. I've managed to go to Kilimanjaro and break a world record for the highest game of football in the world. And then also this year we then went to Jordan beside the Dead Sea and did the lowest game of football in the world. All at the same time as promoting women's equality in sport as well, which has been really great. In Jordan we did some football camps for about 700 young Jordanian girls who were probably between the ages of about 5 and 12 and refereeing was including that which was really nice just to kind of plant that seed at an early age. It was the first time some of them had ever seen a football let alone play with it so just the opportunities to even give back to that have just been incredible. Yeah.